Well, they make you here with another Halo Reach a campaign challenge, and this is Foggy Notion, which requires completion of any mission on Heroic with the Cloud and Famous Skulls activated. And in addition to those two, I activated Grunt Birthday Party just to make it easier to see Grunt headshots at distance. And we chose the Winter, Winter Contingency mission for this because it is a very simple mission to do. Uh, nightfall is a little bit quicker, but uh, team. one can get tired of doing Nightfall repeatedly. Anyway, we'll cut the opening cutscene here. And we still got a little bit yes, of, sir. I guess, forced cutscene to go here before the action starts, before we gain control. Yeah, I'm looking at it. And I'm not going to change my settings. So let's get the action started here. Okay, now finally we're off and running. And I'm just going to run past all the first two encounters with civilians and uh, actually the first uh, two encounters with Covenant. Just try to speed the mission up a little bit. This is also, uh, it makes it a little bit easier to do the mission when you've got the Famine Skull on because enemies... All dropped weapons have only half the ammo they would normally have. We don't need to telegraph a presence. We've lost our uh, motion sensor with the cloud skull on. Okay, I just flicked uh, night vision on here real quick. Go through here like so. Back out to the courtyard. Turn off night vision and just keep following this path here to the second building. vision back on you don't have to do that it just makes it a little easier for me and just through here into this courtyard and into this next building sure everybody's done this before all right let's jump this little railing there and come out here and then jump up here and we're bypassing the first encounter. Heads up, Charlie One. Move down to the lower level. I'm detecting enemy movement. Noble leader, enemy dropships inbound. Visuals on target. I don't know if you'd call that a skip or not. I call it a rush. Enemies. Just rush past the enemies. Alright, now we're uh, doing the same thing here. I actually guess there would be close to three encounters here, but. We're doing the same thing here for the second major group of coveys. We're just going to run right by them. What's next? More contact. And notice when the, I saw the elites, I ducked down here a little bit. Alright, jump through here. Let's grab this vehicle up here. And we're off and running. We're driving. Commander, I'm seeing more hostile activity to the northeast. Camille, you're with Cat. Six and I will run interference on the ground. We'll meet you at the outpost. Get to work, Noble. All right, we got three uh, major encounters. Uh, in this mission. The first is with the trapped uh, troops, which is the one we're headed to now. The second is on the outside of the communications array building, and the third is on the inside of the communications building, communications array building, if you will. Alright, so here we are headed for the first major battle here. I was trying to get this darn uh, broken down uh, hog out of the way. Didn't quite get it. Copy, 
I'm just going to use the haul. I mean, this this little vehicle here, this truck. I'm going to use this uh, to splatter as many of these grunts as I can. Oh! Wonder what I got on the uh, from the judges on that flip. Now, on heroic difficulty, uh, they're not very good shots. So I'm not too worried about getting nailed there by the grunts. Come back through, get another one or two. I think I just got one there. Turn around and try again. Again, this is definitely saving ammo. Alright, got one lonely grunt here. He's running in. Get out of the way, bird. He's running all around, all around. Boom, finally got him. Okay, there'll be two more waves coming in. Each wave will have a bunch of grunts and an elite. So I'm going to head on up here to a little bit of cover and deal with them up here. Now, my AI buddy is a rest of uh, uh, Noble here. Noble company or tune or squad or whatever. They are actively involved as well. You can see the waypoint signs down there. There's the elite. Alright, so I'm just going to sit back here and just take out as many of these grunts as I can. I know my uh, AI buddies are doing the same thing down there. But I'm not in the line of fire. That's the big difference. Here comes the third wave. I overthrew that grenade. I don't know how I got a double kill there. Alright, thinning out the ranks. I'm just about done here. God, bird, get out of the way. Okay, I think that's it. Now, I could have splattered him uh, with the truck, that last lead, but because uh, Mythic and Tilt are not on. He, his shields aren't all that great, so you, you can actually take him out with a pistol. And again, your AI buddies are firing away at him as well. You know, and I thought I grabbed that DMR and I didn't. I was in such a rush to get into the helicopter here, or the uh, Falcon. And off we go to the second major battle. And this does take a little while to get there. There's a neat little trick where you can actually bring the Falcon down with a plasma pistol early on in the mission and sort of fly it on top of one of the spirits and that will take you to the third battle area or the second uh, battle area without having to deal with the first battle area. But I haven't quite mastered that trick yet. One of these days, I'll try it. Okay. Just looking at this pretty scenery here. Nice graphics. We are closing in on the communications relay station. And there'll be several ways of cubbies coming in here, one already on the ground. And the faster we clear them out, the faster we can get to the third battle, which is the inside battle. Still mad that I didn't grab that DMR. There is one up here. Just want to throw a grenade down there. Okay, got one up there. Throw another grenade down there, see if I can get anybody else. And again, we're just sending out the ranks here. I think I can actually take one of these guys out with a, with a back smack. Boom, there he goes. Boom. Oh, got them both. Okay. Got ammo in here. Got uh, cover in here. And let's just start taking out as many coveys as we can. Be mindful that the spirits have main guns that can take you out. You can see them back there at, at the 
back of the uh, at back of the ship. So we just got to keep strafing back and forth to make sure that we don't get nailed by one of those guns. And again, the quicker we take these guys out, the faster we can get to the inside of the, uh, the comm relay building. Ooh, the shields are going, the shields are going. Oh, trying to, what a time to reload. Okay, got him finally. Alright, we should be just about there. Just keep taking them out until the door closes. Okay, door's closing. Now we're getting ready for the final battle here, and I went ahead and turned on night vision. Not much to do while we wait for the door to open. Alright, door opens. We come here, turn left. Come over here, turn left again, skip the cutscene, and we're right into the final battle area. I'd like to take that uh, Elite out before he retreats to the uh, actual comm relay uh, circuitry, if you will. So that I only, at, right at the end I only have one Elite to take out, not two. I was having some problems with these guys. I had to take these guys out first because they were dropping my shields like crazy. There we go. Okay, well, at least I got my shields and my health back. Now I can, ooh, look out, focus on that. He's a concussion rifle elite if you didn't see that. There he is. Alright, he's focused on uh, my AI buddy there. I believe that's uh, George. And now what I'm looking for is plasma pistol. What? Crap, if I can only jump. Alright, there, there will be one up in here. We just gotta clear out this hallway of uh, cubbies. Coming back to Halo Reach after playing other Halo games is a little difficult with the DMR because of the bloom. You have to time your shots with the DMR so that you don't get too much bloom and you be a little bit more accurate. Get that guy out. And I find that I sometimes I do a little bit more rapid fire than I should. I'm not timing my shots. Oh, let's look at them all bunched together. Big grenade. Boom, that takes care of all those guys. And I'm going to go back here and get some ammo. So with a DMR in reach, you really have to pace your shots. Or your reticule starts to grow and your fire becomes much less accurate. All right, somewhere along the way there, I picked up a plasma pistol. And now we've got four grunts and one elite left. And the elite is a sword elite. A couple different ways to attack him. 
the fact that he only he doesn't have uh, double health or shields and uh, it's heroic I'm gonna be a little bit more aggressive and I thought I almost got myself caught here see how he's going after uh, George there oh then he saw me I'm, I'm sweating bullets right there but notice that uh, the EMP dropped his shields and I just hauled him in his tracks and I was able to switch over to the DMR and take him out with a headshot. So that's it. That's uh, Foggy Notion. Uh, any mission heroic on heroic difficulty with a famine and the cloud skull on. And again, I chose winter contingency for this. Uh, there we go. Here's the challenge score. I hope this helps you in your quest for the reach foggy notion uh, campaign challenge this is old and signing off